What can we do to build a more inclusive society? Jewel Feguni and Adia Ivy think this is just a matter of empathy. Even if, ever so slightly, our genuine human experience can be lived through each other, especially for minorities and marginalized groups, we won't have to do any convincing about why it's important to have an inclusive and diverse society. You Matter Studios has set out to do just that by creating virtual reality films to throw you into the perspective of someone whose life is unlike yours. I got the awesome chance over the course of several days to show you what it's like for Jewel, Adia, and the rest of the undergraduate You Matter team to prepare for their first cinematic feature VR film, The Drive. Let's get right into it. Welcome, I apologize in advance. Okay, yeah, so this is the house. <laughs> yeah. The reason why it's usually messy is because I'm a student and then I'm running a startup, but my roommate is president of several committees. Every single minute is counts in this day. So I like, like putting, I love writing things out. I kind of like to see like my whiteboard is kind of my brain. This is my calendar of inspirational black women. Frick, I just remembered. So at 4.15, you and me are going to the CS department to pick up the camera. And these are all things that I need to get today, get done today. It is definitely a time where we're gaining a lot of like coverage and like recognition. I guess in a way, I am grateful to be a black woman in this space because it's still a rarity. <laughs> sacrifice your needs it comes back to bite you if I would have at least gone some sleep I probably would have not been dealing with this now that's the building that's the building if we run we could just park like anywhere thank you yeah, sure. thank you so much thank you <laughs> sir we're having like a documentary done right now so so this camera is a 360 camera um, but the amazing part is that it shoots up to 8k and it's also the camera I used to record my first VR film you want to see this beautiful parking this is what happens when you're in a rush <laughs> all right let's go to the meeting <sighs> see y'all trying to like build a bridge between communities. You have to build it from both directions. Start from both sides and meet in the middle. When we're like creating stuff, we can't like make it like super anti-police or super pro-police, you know? You have to make sure that you are making it pro like objectivity and pro understanding and empathy. That we're trying to make something that is as like fair and balanced as we can. auditioning but we're late um, but one guy has to go we don't want to lose any candidates because you never know who's gonna be the one would you mind being the reader so I can focus on thinking perfect so what I'm looking for in these candidates is I'm looking for conviction I want to be able to relate with them so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start from page eight Conrad Waller officer will Hey there, you've been awfully busy today, huh? Shit, Dave, what did I tell you about sneaking up on me like that? Again. I said put your yeah. hands where I can see them. Put your hands where I can see them. So, we're going to be reviewing auditions this weekend, and we will let you know. 
it was like my first internship, right? And there's a hackathon. And I really was interested in designing a game that had my sister as the main character because I was so sick of her not finding an avatar that looked like her. And I felt like that this was a problem that many children from other marginalized groups would have a problem with. So I was like, why not I try to create this game? And that evolved into just having a studio that focused on creating games on improving representation in media. Representation is, it's, I cannot put into words how powerful it is, especially, especially for a child's development. I really just wanted to infiltrate that with You Matter Studios and create media that improve representation. I want her to be able to see that she can accomplish and do anything she wants to. I want her to be able to see herself more on screen. And I know this film does not directly accomplish that, but it's like the seed, it's the foundation of what else we can accomplish. All right, I'm ready. Damien. Oh, he's on that phone. Did he start eating before he said grace? Sorry, Mom. I told you I gotta, I gotta go soon. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Where should I put the blunt? Put it out. Fucking throw it out. I don't know. Don't. Y'all don't realize how loud this car is. Perfect. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> nice to meet you. Well, nice guys, you too. too. Okay, let me. I'm happy. And now, my beautiful co producer is here. Hi. Coming to save the day. I think the biggest thing is I've never worked with VR 360 film. Determining those like technological obstacles and doing the research behind it and doing a lot of tech rehearsals is gonna be the main objective. And so my biggest goal is just making sure that we give this story like the justice that it needs and for it to be well told instead of it just being seen as a student project. But in order to do that, we gotta make it good, which I'm sh we're working on that. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Man, watch the road. Yo, yo, I got this. Why would he turn on his sirens? It's, that's so confusing. You know why I pulled you over? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think she'd be fun to work with. Yeah, she would. <laughs> no! <laughs> I just want to like, I hope so, watch this. I wish that we could just start doing projects and projects, but we gotta finish this one first. Yo, hey, if you're watching this, please subscribe. <laughs> <laughs>